nothing to say. This is well, we are here in the middle of a layout of oil field development, maybe in phase two of phase 10, uh, developing the whole plant site. So this is what goes on here. Looking at here, uh, Kelsey. This is just going to be a, uh, they're going to feed into this line and then these are all T's. It's going to branch stuff off like uh, like this. Uh, Turn around. You count. One, two, three. It's pretty simple. Got it. Mm -hmm. See, so these pipes, both of these pieces start off with an angle. It's just called a bevel. Mm -hmm. What they do, out. yeah, see right here? See how this has a, a degree angle? Yep. The welders, when they when they connect it, when they put the pipe right here, all they're doing is filling that gap up and it melts all that metal. Mm -hmm. So that's what that's how you that's how you connect two pieces of pipe together. Alright, excellent, excellent. That's a nice shot of this whole piece. See so look at this. And our our first identification is here, and then with the arrow going down, our second one's gonna be down here and so on. And that that's a, a number belt, or what we call it. And all it is is a piece of tape or something that holds lead numbers onto the pipe. And like Kelsey said, it's just used for identification purposes for our film. But, and, and then so, also this is a, a T fitting. And with T fittings, they're gonna be a little bit out of shape to regular pipe. And so you can see the high low as presented here. What? See, it's, it's thicker. This side is thicker than this side because this is a fitting. It's not necessarily thicker, it's just a, set a, differently. Uh, correct. When it's molded, mm -hmm. it's set differently than the pipe. Because sometimes you can, either side can be egg shaped a little bit, and then you've got to fill in. You see that area right there where it's. Mm -hmm. So you can see, still see the bevel on that. Mm -hmm. And this is called a false bevel when you see it on film. Yeah. Like so that, this is an example of. You don't have to come in and fill that in. Uh, well, it's an example of external undercut, or yeah, undercut where they didn't do it. But with that bevel like that, um, the welding inspector uh, released it. That's a good deal. So I rotate them, I get them in the right direction. Um, and then what I do is I check the uh, penny placement on these. Uh, it's gonna have two, two uh, IQIs on it. So, and then uh, I check the information that the customer wants. The weld number is on here. Uh, the date is on here. Um, and then th when we're talking about uh, our indicators uh, that are around the pipe, the A is our first indicator, and then our B, you know, and then so on. And then, then when you get back down to a D, then your A is your last indicator, okay? So, and then what we also do is look for indications in the well to make sure that the integrity of what we're shooting is correct. So like we're saying, you can see the shadow right there. Well, it also comes across there since that's D, it should be there as well, okay? So um, that's, that's stuff that we look for. And, and then the other thing that, uh, one problem that we have in, in digitizing like this is if they shot this shot longer or shorter than the other shots, the density's gotta be off, yep. okay? So what I've been able to do is when I export it into Photoshop, I can select the section and just do the section contracts. Um, can I do that here? A section shot across, I'm not sure. Measuring the ODS. Okay. You, you can measure now, the OD over a, a line. That's what when I when I uh, right click on here, I know I can manipulate. You told me yeah. I can do that. Here we go. This is Eagles Mobile Lab. Here you go. Here you pull up. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay, this is the six foot. Yeah, six, six foot mobile app. This is all that's 
all the space they have for a six foot mobile lab. There are the dryers up here for the film. Thick pipe rounds. Mm -hmm. Okay, now here's what they call a pipe T. Oh my gosh, sinking in the mud here. So look at how big. Yeah, there's Kelsey. <laughs> how big that sucker is. Wow. <laughs> 